Hey, Big Woods family, it's Pastor Tim. I just wanted to take a moment to say thank you very much. In a very challenging year, you have shown love and care and grace to one another. Many people have had to make many, many adjustments, changes in school and changes in work. We know ones that have lost loved ones, people that have faced sickness and discouragement and certainly fear. And I know for a fact that many calls and texts have been sent and made. We know that many, many meals have been prepared. Even flowers have been delivered. I know that lawns were mowed for people and leaves are now being raked just to be an encouragement. I think more than anything else, I am grateful. I want to thank you for the prayers that have been faithful and the truth that has been told. Uh, just last night, Wendy and I were meeting with our home group and we were talking about what Jesus said in John chapter 16. He says that in this world, you will have trouble, but take heart. I have overcome the world. And that is such good news, needed news for us right now. As we continue to face more changes, we're, we're now coming inside to worship after an entire season of worshiping outside. And this is going to be another change. It's going to be another challenge for many people. And so I, I want to remind you that together we need to make this a priority. A church are people that have been set apart for a purpose and they're called to gather. That means to be together. There was a time that we, we needed to stay home and to worship online. But there may still be a time for some that need to do that. There may be a few. But please don't allow the coronavirus to be an excuse to stay home and worship in your bathrobe. The, the church is to be together. We're to worship together, fellowship together. We sing songs together. We sit and we listen and we learn about the truth of God's word together. And we need to hear that. This coming Sunday, I want to remind you that in 25 years of preaching, I've never preached through the entire book of Romans. And we're going to begin a series. And I'm going to do that. Um, Romans, the time for truth is now. Now more than ever before, we need to understand basic foundational doctrines and truth and theology. And so I invite you to come this coming Sunday, October the 11th, 9 o'clock a.m. We're going to meet right here. We're going to take all the precautions that are necessary. Um, we will social distance and some will wear masks. And if you want to wear a mask, that's fine. And please be respectful um, and continue to be loving and show grace and care to one another. It says that we are not to forsake the assembling of ourselves together. And so I encourage you to make Sunday a priority as we gather and we worship and we celebrate the goodness and grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. I look forward to seeing you on Sunday. Lord bless.